What's up, world? It's your boy, Elsa. You heard. It's action. Fredo. We are live on Twitch doing our thing, taking your request to the next level. This is Easy Mill 24 bars. Now, I know what he's capable of. I know. Like, you know, I'm starting to holistically get a grip on this guy. You know, I'm not surprised that he can play the guitar, that he's got rock songs, that he's got rap songs, that he can sing all of this you know what i'm saying he's the full package so now i'm to the point to where i'm just ready to just see that full package come to life every time i click an easy meal video so 24 bars hmm my favorite rapper well one of my favorite rappers in high school was the game he just dropped a song with kanye west like yesterday or something like that but oh, yeah. the game released a track called 300 bars Oh, I remember you that. You remember 300 bars? Oh, yeah, I remember that. I'm trying to get this mic out of my face. That has nothing to do with this. <laughs> <laughs> but We're pretty random, though, so we say whatever we think. It don't matter. Yeah, man, I just had a flashback of the game rapping 300 bars. I think he was dissing G-Unit because he got like kicked out. Did you, did you? Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. Well, yeah, that's, that's completely irrelevant, but uh, let us know in the comments if you like G-Unit as well as Easy Milk. <laughs> Yep, let's do it. Here's what's going on. Here's what's going on. I got to let this mug run all the way through so we ain't going to pause and talk about it in the end. And one thing, one reason why is because the subtitles are flipping when he switches language. Yeah. And I yeah. was like, wait, I want to catch all these bars. But like, I definitely had to get used to being like, do I, I was over here like, did I cut the lyrics on? Like, what's going on? So we going to run this mug back and give it a full go. Shai, so me sit sa gilid ng himig ng aking pag-ibig chonke ang piniling ihitid maliban sa kisig ng tinig ng parang sa tenga ninyo ay nararo wala sa inyong mananalo pag ako ang dumalo sundalo sa bunot ng parel ko mang gago ng talo magingat ang lahat sa pagpili ng inyong manlalaro kasi I didn't come to play with you chump bitches who think this a fun business or one click is that I'll come and buck when it's none witness to live off a crunk grimness you stuck sitting in your sleep like I when it's stuck riches but that ain't the case cause I didn't get it you Place. I'm leaving holes in your humble the bowl of patterns face in the summer long it's no one no more who you pin on a knock no he's sung leave with some some not put one long to talk yeah di na to pato sumakatarong pag ako sumali why time got weird na kaya gumamit ang tatlong lingwahe die up in the coffins where you were destined to be i'ma just rest in the lead and flex on your bitch cause i just killed you for free Old school up in this motherfucking party Like we switching the blades and tipping the babes And making sure my flow is boom bap Not that new trap where the high hats go like That repetitive shit, keep begging your bitch You just jealous cause she wanna kiss my neck and my dick Cause heaven is rich, I rob it with my devilish click And 22 double O's what I'ma rap on the shit Oh yeah Mark, you suck at making beats <laughs> <laughs> who was hey. mark mark just got hey. dissed he just told mark he was a mark <laughs> <laughs> yo so th th what i like about easy mill is his ability to be able to to switch languages like that remaining super clear with his dialect it's like no fumbling of the words no like you know words merging together and as an artist that's extremely hard to do and i feel like he does a great job of that he always has his full presence there like all of his energy is always there you know whether it be like him expressing himself whatever emotion it is yeah. it's always there uh from my listening standpoint i love this this type this like type of rap which is like freestyle based stuff but i quit listening to it just because of like a lot of the messages behind majority of it like i don't listen to music with a lot of curs cursing or any you know derogatory statements like around the house or in the car around my family or whatever. But yeah, other than that, man, it just shows once again, he's extremely talented. 
And uh, yeah, like I said, I appreciate this style, but it's, it's not something that I I typically listen to anymore. Uh, yeah, I would say I'm very similar. Uh, this is the style of music that I grew up listening to. So when I see him paying homage to you know true hip hop, like I'm wow because he has bars. He definitely has flow. Uh, he brings the vibe every time. He just gives me this fierceness that uh you know he's a young hungry artist. Yeah. That's what I like the most about him. You know, he's just intense with it. Another thing, too, and, like, I don't know how long he's been putting music out or when he started, but he gives me the vibe of, like, no excuses, use what you have. Like, I know a lot of people, even me in particular, have been in a lot of moments where I'm like, no, nah, man, you know, I don't want to set up my cell phone to do this freestyle or – you know, I'll wait till Fredo get the camera back and this, this, that. But like Easy Mill is just like, no, I'm getting it I'm getting it done. Like I've seen multiple of his videos have, you know, millions and hundreds of thousands of views and the quality is not the best. And that just should that just like debunks all myths of like, of course we want better quality, but done is better than perfect. And I remember you said that to me a long time ago. Yeah, man, he's living that and um Ultimately, it's just the content and what you're putting out rather than, you know, the the visual quality, you yeah. know, because, you know, it's always important to present yourself in, you know, a good manner. But ultimately, what matters the most is what's is the message that you're putting out or the skill or the talent that you bring in, you know, so. Yeah. Uh, salute to this guy. Yeah, very talented. Sure. Very talented. And all he's shown us is just that he's consistent. He gets stuff done. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? And he's he's very uh very unique and versatile. You know what I'm saying? His oh. his flow is very polished. Like yeah. the way he approaches the beat is like I'm starting to get a grip on his style. And he has his own style. I think that's what separates him. And two, like, I don't speak, you know, the Filipino language, but it was very intriguing to hear the dialect because he spit it so cleanly and he kind of intertwined it with English. So I'm like, that's what really captured my attention. Yeah. Last thing I'll say about his style, too, is like he doesn't waste any of the beat. Like uh, sometimes rappers will kind of get this approach to a beat to where they're kind of like riding with it. Everything that I've heard him on is like, He's there to showcase his ability over top of the beat, if that makes sense, like becoming one with it or just literally just being like, I just need this beat to keep me on cadence and like I'm destroying it. And he definitely has that capability. And uh, I don't know if Mark made this beat. I thought the beat was decent. But somebody <laughs> let me know in the comments who Mark is and what you know links he has to his beat so I can comment and tell him if he sucks or not. And uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, for sure. So hey. thank you, Jaden, for this request. Mm -hmm. And thank you all for tuning in live on Twitch. This is our VIP stream. You can watch us free on Twitch. It doesn't cost you a dime. Or you can support us by joining our Patreon and giving us requests and watching exclusive content. Yeah, yeah. Till next time. Yo. Much love. Every time I've